Hello wrestling fans of the world, I am your host, The Martian, Skylar Mars. If you have the passion, if you have the love for it, then I say go for it. If you want to be um, successful at something, you have to obsess over it to the point where it's unhealthy. Because your actions speak louder than your words, and your attitude is everything. This is your Martian, Skylar Mars, and we have ourselves a Wrestle Crate. This is my first Wrestle Crate, and I'll be doing the unboxing. However, money's tight. This is the standard Wrestle Crate, not the Ultimate Crate. Um, not a lot of the objects are supposed to be different. What's supposed to be different is the figure inside, from my understanding. Instead of it being a Mattel Elite figure, it's a Mattel Basic, which I don't mind. So this is okay for me. Now, one thing I just want to point out is that the box itself looks to be a bit dented. I think that's just a problem with my mailer, though. I hope none of the inside is damaged. I've got a screwdriver. Let's uh, open this box. Okay. Should be good. The box is pretty easy to open. No need to tear it. This is like Christmas. The first thing I see is some WWE trading cards. I'm going to pop this open. We're going to see what's inside. Oh, wow. There are quite a few in here. It's going to take me a while. All right. We start with a Coco Beware card. I'm not going to read the back of any of these. There are too many of them. Lex Luger and Sting. Alicia Fox. Dean Ambrose. The Rock. A special WWE 2K16 version of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Joey Mercury. Wow. He looks so different with hair. Because if you remember from JJ Security, he's all bald now, so it's just so different. Victor from The Ascension. And a Then and Now card of Zack Ryder. Now, what's really cool is, this didn't come with a crate, but I happen to have this. I have this special WWE cards tin I got from a friend of mine with Edge and so many other cards. Stars kind of engraved on it. So kind of just by coincidence, I can pop all these in. Okay. We have the t-shirt. Ooh, it's very soft. Very happy about that. Now it says, Fight Forever. That's it. It just says Fight Forever. I, What I remember Fight Forever being referenced to was Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn because... They have a very long-standing feud. They fought a number of times over ROH and WWE history, so Fight Forever was just something they had, but this could be in reference to something else. If you know what Fight Forever is in reference to, or if you can explain it at all to me, please leave a comment in the description, um, below. And then finally, we have the basic figure. I thought a pop vinyl was going to come with this. It is... Oh, I'm so happy right now. What it doesn't say what series this is. So I'm not going to be able to tell you, but this is the unpainted Finn Balor. And even though this is not the painted version of Finn, I'm very happy to have this, because I don't have Finn yet. Let's see if it says, it. again, it doesn't say the series on it, but whatever. So this is, well, we all botch eventually. So that will be our Wrestle Crate. For this month, I'll see you guys next time.